the wild coast. It is beautiful. It is rugged. It is remote. And it is very tough indeed. This land of rolling hills and deep cleft valleys is no place for pretenders. Getting there is an extreme challenge in itself due to the poor condition of the gravel roads in the area. The locals who live and work here refer to these coastal tracks as Injela as well as Hokueni. This translates as the roads from hell. Life continues though, and one of the lifelines of the rural economy are the trucks delivering bread to the spaza shops, building material from hardware stores, drinking water to homes, as well as countless other necessities. Once you venture onto these eroded gravel strips, you will soon realize you need an extraordinary truck to survive the harsh road conditions dished up by these Eastern Cape tracks. On the wild coast, that vehicle is the Isuzu F-Series truck, the king of the road. And it is no wonder it has won the hearts and minds of local truck owners due to its reliability and robustness. We ventured into this rural and off-grid heartland to witness exactly what makes these trucks so popular in this region. There seems to be an Isuzu truck in the majority of homestead in this area. You see these hardy vehicles everywhere on the roads, from Mazepa Bay to Port St. John's, all the way inland to Ukathamba Ranges. Because this is where the Isuzus thrive, despite the challenging terrain. My name is Mzukisi Mesani. I stay at Kongre uh, on the wild coast. The roads, it's very bad. That's the problem. The user to load the sand, uh, blocks, water, uh, and anything for building materials. Yeah, I love Isuzu because Isuzu is strong, strong, it's very strong. You see me, I start early, early, from 3 o'clock, 1 o'clock, and then I, I park the truck after 7 later. Man, I'm a businessman. You can't sleep if you are a businessman. My name is Ella, my surname is Mesan. When I grow up, I want to be a lawyer. <laughs> Yeah. Every F-Series truck begins its journey here at Isuzu's vehicle assembly plant in Kabeha. We've come to see exactly how these trucks are built to better understand what makes the F-Series such a dependable and popular truck. We learned that the answer boils down to the fact that Isuzu employees take their pride in the company's heritage because every worker understands that Isuzu trucks are essential for transporting goods all over SA and our neighboring southern countries. The undeniable truth is that these F-Series trucks drive the Southern African subcontinent's economy every hour of every day. Getting goods from towns to isolated villages 
is tough here on the wild coast. The gravel roads are often washed away during the rainy season, making for deeply rutted roads which are taxing on vehicles. They therefore form a key part of the local infrastructure and serve the community on a daily basis, delivering food, supplies and hope to remote villages. This is why they are so dependent upon these kings of the wild coast. Without them, their economy would come to an abrupt halt. Okay, first of all, I welcome you. My name is Suvielwa Nsendwana. I was born in Amtata, Kokolweni location. This shop was our first building here. Sometimes because of these bad roads, because of rain, we can't come here. Those trucks are playing a big role here. They are delivering sand, crest stone, water. You have to go to those people who are owning Isuzu trucks. Because the Isuzu in Amanda, they said Isuzu is powerful. This is Africa, and our work here is never done. Once the trucks roll off our Isuzu assembly line, they make their way to our network of dealers around Southern Africa. These are vehicles that keep Mzansi moving. These are the legends who own the roads, who feed the nation and service remote communities, not only in the Eastern Cape heartland, but throughout our rainbow nation. The Isuzu F-Series, truly, the kings of the wild coast.